Hello and welcome to this EXO tutorial where we will give you a breakdown of the EXO space where EXO collects all your one-shot drum samples and sorts them by similarity. To move around through the EXO space simply hold your right mouse button and drag the mouse. Zooming in is done by scrolling upwards or downwards on your mouse wheel or using the plus slash minus sign found in the bottom right hand corner of XO. For a smoother zoom, hold down shift and scroll the mouse wheel. You preview samples by either left clicking with your mouse or simply by dragging or sweeping across the space. Even though the EXO space may seem overwhelming at first, the samples are organized in patterns. For any given sample or sound, EXO positions the surrounding samples by similarity. Each sample also gets color tagged based on probability. A sample surrounded by symbol samples is more likely to be a symbol than a kick. This results in sample clusters like kicks, snares, percussion, hi-hats or toms. If you find a sound very close to what you're looking for, you can take advantage of the similarity function by using the left and right arrow key on your keyboard. EXO will then suggest similar samples to the one you found or selected. By pressing Refresh Similarity List, you set a new point of reference. If you happen to sweep by something you like, you can always backtrack using the history buttons or the up and down arrows on your keyboard. When you find an interesting sample, you can store it for later by adding it to your favorites. But that's something we'll get back to in another episode. Okay, so we have the sample we want. Now let us drag and drop it into our door session to create a WAV file for it by Control or Alt Option for Mac and dragging it in with your mouse. You can also drag and drop the desired sample into the Finder or Explorer directly or straight onto your desktop as I've done here. This covers the basics of the EXO space. Now put on your spacesuit and begin exploring. Yeah. <laughs>